Okay. Now earlier on I made um, an uh, adaptation to the electronics um, by adding a MOSFET for the hotbed and um, decided now to build a um, print an enclosure to keep it, I know it's only 12 volts but there's a lot of current there so I didn't want to short it out um, and so just building an enclosure that's specific for that MOSFET board it's going to take forever it's already been nearly two hours and it's uh, seven percent but there you go it's coming out pretty well um, I think we got this uh, the bed cracked I put um, when I say cracked uh, sorted um, I put uh, PEI, polyethylene, um, something or other, um, sheet on the on the aluminium bed, and that gives uh, enough transparency for the um, induction, the induction, induction, auto leveling, but uh, it gives a smooth and uh, sticky surface to the, for the actual hot bed itself. So. That's yeah, coming out quite well, it's just staying where it is, which is good. It's really, even though it takes forever, it really is quite mesmerizing and therapeutic to watch. Anyway, that's the uh, Tron XY X3A doing its stuff, modified with a, an E3D. Hot end, and soon to have its own cooling fan. That's the end of the day, folks.